Can you solve this calculus challenge question? Let's solve it in two minutes. We have an integral with respect to t, and x appears in the bound. So this immediately reminds us of the first part of the fundamental theorem of calculus. Using this, we can find the derivative of f. f prime of x will just be the integrand with t replaced by x. We know that f is the inverse of g. This means that f of g of x must be x. Let's differentiate this. We get f prime of g of x times g prime by the chain rule, and this must be equal to 1, the derivative of x with respect to itself. Let's solve for g prime of x. And now, f prime of x is already known to us. So, replacing x by g of x allows us to rewrite the denominator purely in terms of g. So far, so good. With this, we are able to take a second derivative to find g double prime. We can use the chain rule twice. We'll bring the power down, subtract the power by 1, and then multiply by the derivative of the inside. This is applying the chain rule. But the inside derivative itself involves the chain rule as well. And now, we know g prime of x. And the beautiful thing about it is that this is precisely the reciprocal of this term, meaning that this term and g prime will cancel each other out, giving us 3 over 2 g squared of x. So, we can find the ratio of the second derivative of g to the square of g, and this works out to be 3 halves. So, there you have it. Could you figure it out?